Um, okay, okay, so before this video starts, I, I just want to say I have no idea how to pronounce this word. Is it like Deshamba or Deshambe? Because according to this, it's Deshambe. But according to this pronunciation, uh, Deshambe. Deshambe! Deshambe! So I have no idea how to pronounce it. So I don't know, feel free to fight about it. I don't know. Welcome to Channel 93 News. My name is Lance. And I'm Melissa. Oh, fudge. <laughs> <laughs> and today we're going to take a look at the weather and climate. The Shamba, known for its warm and hot climate, is going to experience in the next 24 hours. Yeah. So let's get right into the weather forecast. Yes, that's right, Lance. As he just said, we're going to be describing the weather and the climate of Deshanba. This April, the people of Deshanba will be experiencing a pretty sunny day with little to no precipitation in the next 24 hours, while its temperature will be moderately placed around 15 degrees Celsius. It will be a fantastic day for Deshanba. Now, why is that, Melissa? Viewing this obviously luxuriously made climograph, of course. Observe as Deshambu's temperatures slowly increase as the months go by, most of which being above 10 degrees Celsius, explaining why Deshambu's climate is known to be very hot, especially in the summer. And because of this graph, we can, we can clearly see that because of its average temperatures, that it will be around 15 degrees Celsius tomorrow in Deshambu. And to also add in, we can also predict that tomorrow will be a relatively dry day for Deshambu, judging from the scale for precipitation and the blue bars of the graph, staying low at around 17 millimeters in precipitation. Wait, how do you know that the temperature is in degrees Celsius? Are you American? Well, I got deported here, so, um... Look with your eyes, you fool! <laughs> if you actually weren't blind, you would have noticed the side title on this beautiful climograph describing these temperatures are indeed in Celsius. So how does this compare to a fat city like Toronto? Give me that. According to this climograph, the difference between Toronto and Deshamba's temperatures start off quite similar in January, but then as the months continue to their past temperatures begin to differ. Because of this climograph, we can safely say that it will be around 7 degrees Celsius in the next 24 hours, which is about half of Deshamba's predicted temperatures of 15 degrees Celsius. Furthermore, the precipitation in Toronto is also far greater than of Deshamba, as shown on the graphs. This may explain why we mostly get more rainfall and snowfall than Deshamba, as well as having a higher total annual precipitation with 819 millimeters compared to their 210 millimeters. This temperature is also the result of a cooler climate considering the Deshamba has the complete opposite of Toronto. Since their average annual temperature is 14.6 Celsius and Toronto's is 8.9 Celsius. So what have we learned here today? Uh, that Bernie Sanders was the fattest Tune in next week where we discuss the location of the fattest man on earth right here on channel 93 news. Thank you Martin and Spencer for being the replacement Melissa's and the replacement camera crew. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs>